Good day, everyone. My name is S. H. Yao, spokesman of Taiwan government. Declaration of Taiwan government. In her decision for Lin versus United States, Judge Janice Roger Brown acknowledged that a American and China to merchants relationship over the past sixty years has trapped the inhabitants of Taiwan in political purgatory. B. During this time, the people in Taiwan have lived without any uniformly recognized government. C. In practical terms, this means they have uncertain status in the world community, which infects the population's day-to-day -day lives. Number one. On April 25th, 2013, a group of concerned Taiwanese formally announced the establishment of the Taiwan Autonomous Government, following international legal procedures on the basis of the 1952 San Francisco Peace Treaty, the 1952 Treaty of Taipei, the 1979 Taiwan Relations Act, and the United States Constitution. On March 25, 2014, the United States House Foreign Affairs Committee unanimously reaffirmed the importance of the Taiwan Relations Act. In the words of Congressman Alan Grayson, we can and should support Taiwanese desire for self-determination. On April 3, 2014, Assistant Secretary of State Daniel Russell testified before the Senate Foreign Relations Committee that strong United States support for Taiwan autonomy helps give our friends in Taiwan the confidence to strengthen their cross strait relations. The people of Taiwan have suffered tremendously over the last 70 years beginning with the Tutu A massacre, followed by the White Terror and 38 years of martial law. Even now, the mass media education and national resources are still controlled by the mainlander-dominated Republic of China, ROC regime in exile, which continues to oppress the Taiwanese people through deception and intimidation. But now, the Taiwanese people have finally woken up. They refuse to continue to be oppressed. They want to government of the people, by the people, and for the people. They yearn for genuine democracy and genuine freedom. Number two, the ROC was established in 1912, and its constitution written in 1946. At both times, Taiwan was ruled by Japan, not the ROC. The ROC regime in exile, therefore, has no right to rule Taiwan, nor does its constitution apply to Taiwan. We hereby announce the relocation of the headquarters of Taiwan government, USA, from USA to Taiwan. Number three, the ROC regime in exile has time and again responded to Taiwanese civic movements with violence, whether through the state apparatus or criminal process. If the ROC regime in exile does so again now, it will be responsible for the consequences. Number four. The Kingdom of Tongning and the Republic of Formosa showed that the Taiwanese people have fought for and won their freedom before. We call upon the people of Taiwan to join us in doing so once again. Number five, a free and secure Taiwan will contribute to peace and stability in Asia and the world. The Taiwan Autonomous Government 
therefore appeals to the international community. Most of all fellow democracies for recognition and support. The Taiwan Autonomous Government will uphold the highest standard of democracies, freedom, and human rights. We will build a Taiwan of the people, by the people, and for the people in the spirit of the Ten Commandments, the Universal Declaration of Human Rights, the Mayflower Compact, the Declaration of Independence, and the Constitution of the United States. Thank you very much. Thank you.